Hello friends, welcome to the channel. Today in this video, we are going to discuss about how to change Azure SQL pricing tier. Suppose you have created an Azure SQL database in, you, in Azure portal and later on you want to or you have decided to change the pricing tier based on the requirement and how you can do that. It's quite easy and that steps we are going to discuss in as part of this video tutorial. Okay. So for that, what we'll do is let's start a quick demo so, so that I can show you where exactly you have to go, what are the steps you need to follow to change the Azure SQL pricing tier in Azure portal. Okay. So let's navigate to uh, Azure portal. I'll just open portal.azure.com. So basically, once you will uh, go here, uh, portal.azure.com, it might ask you for login. Since I have already logged in, so it is just to redirect, redirect me to here. Okay. So this is the Azure portal. What you need to do is once you are logged in, just search for SQL database. You can able to see the search result here, SQL databases, right? Click on that, SQL databases. Then you will see the list of SQL databases that you have created or Azure SQL database whatever you have created. You will see the complete list here. Then the one you want to change the pricing tire, you can click on that specific database. So I'm clicking here. And once you will click there, it will redirect you to the SQL database page, that specific SQL database page. Okay. Then just see here from the left navigation, mm -hmm. click on the compute plus storage option. You can able to see which is under the settings tab. Click on the compute plus storage. So once you click there, here, you can able to see here service tier, right? Service and compute tier. Here you can able to see a drop down called service tier. Okay. So there you have to change the service tier based on your requirement, right? So whatever you will change based on that, the pricing structure also will change. Okay. Suppose if you want premium. That is the highest availability and performance. So performance and availability wise, it is very good. So they will charge you also more on this. Correct. So now what you need to do is you have to change the pricing tier. Say I will choose the basic one because I just want for uh, development perspective. Mm -hmm. So for less demanding workloads. Now what you need to do is click on the apply button as the next word uh, step, right? So basically, you have to choose the service tier category from here based on your requirement, okay? Then once you will select that from the service tier drop down, click on the apply button. Mm -hmm. Okay, once you will click on the apply button, you can able to see here. So it started processing, it started making the changes, okay? So here it will show you all the details like uh, what was there and what you are trying to change, which tire and all, all details. So once it is done, it will notify here saying that it is done or something. So let's wait for that. It might take a few seconds. So it will click on the notify button also. You can able to see here the details. So it is still in progress. Certification. Then you can able to see scale data with success. Okay. So successfully scaled from general purpose uh, to the basic one. You can able to see clearly it is mentioned here. Okay. So earlier it was general purpose for me. Then I have converted it to or change it to basic one. Right. So this is how you can change the service tier of your Azure SQL database. Okay, following these steps. Uh, that's it for today. I thought to show you how to change the service tier for your Azure SQL database using Azure. 
So I have also written uh, an article on this particular topic. That article link, I'm going to put it in the video description. You can just cross check once. There also you'll get all these tests. Okay. Thanks a lot for watching this video. If you like the video, kindly subscribe to our channel so that you'll get lots of free videos on different Azure articles along with different helpful Azure PowerShell command. Thank you. Have a nice day. Bye-bye.